Welcome back to the channel. I'm camping uh, this time and uh, staying in Mid Wales near the town called Donald Gethly. Um, the uh, campsite that I'm actually staying at is the Torrent Walk. Um, I've stayed here before, it's a fantastic little place. I'm going to show you around and give you a bit of a little guided tour of the place, but um, just check out the view that I've got from my, uh, my pitch. Torrent Walk campsite is in the southern part of Snowdonia, quite close to Mid Wales. It's situated only 1.2 miles away from Dolgethai, which has a multitude of different shops, cafes, hotels and restaurants, of which I can highly recommend the Royal Ship Hotel for food and the Torrent Walk Hotel for food as well. Right in the centre there's a camping shop that will do all the outdoor necessities and there's also a fantastic cake shop which do incredible sandwiches, pasties and of course cakes. Also there is a bike shop should you be uh, bringing your bikes and heading over to Coedy Brennan or Dovey Bike Park. Check out the link to the Torrent Walk campsite and there's loads of information on there to help you. Now the reason why I've picked this campsite it's quite simple. It's right bang in between two of my most favourite spots for mountain biking. Dovey Bike Park and Cody Brennan. They are literally 20 minutes either side of the campsite. For Dovey Bike Park, head south for 20 minutes and you'll be there. For Coidy Brennan, head north for 20 minutes and again you'll be there. And Dolgethly is literally a five minute drive away where there is great parking, great shops, great restaurants, great pubs, bike shop, climbing shop, outdoor shop, you name it, everything's there that you need. Welcome to my happy place. Welcome to my playground. Two seconds easy up for three people and uh, 
it's nice and compact. And what a view. Let's go and have a little look at what the campsite has to offer then. Let's head down there. The campsite's nice and quiet at the moment. There's more camping over there in that field there. Electric hookups everywhere. And this is where the reception and the toilet block is. Really clean and tidy shower block, loos, wash basins, little cubicles. Oh. dryers, nice washroom as well, so you can uh, wash all your mucky bike gear, uh, washing machine and uh, dryer prices, microwave, fridge, freezer, it's everything you could possibly need. Oh, there's even some kettles down there, some sugar, that's sweet. <laughs> There's also a washing up area where you can do all your uh, your after meal, after cooking, washing up, which kind of really helps. And it's nice hot water as well. Well important defibrillator just in case. Hopefully never be uh, needed. There's reception, there's more showers for ladies and gents there, outside loos, so there's extra stuff there which is really good. There's bike storage, which I believe there is a key for um, in the lockup unit, which is quite useful and it's got individual hangers inside. And then around the corner there is a dedicated bike wash, which is absolutely spot on and it is very good. Uh, and I believe it takes a pound. I'll uh, double check that. Oh, there you go. <laughs> One pound coin, happy days. This is where I stayed before, uh, the last uh, visit, which was in uh, April of this year for my 50th. And it is the uh, bunkhouses, which are absolutely fantastic. There's uh, three bunk beds, six people, and uh, all the bedding's in there. There's a communal kitchen. is all fully equipped and again it's uh, really good there's even a telly in there as well for those evening shows and a lovely area with a fire pit as well really nice and oh, there's even a barbecue at the other under the uh, under the little roof there as well so it, this place is really well kitted out for those wanting a little more luxury I do believe this cottage is also for uh, rent. Um, I'll put details um, in the description below of uh, Torrent Walk so you can actually uh, get on onto their website. Oh, there we go, room seven. So room seven just over there relates to this one here. Really cool pods as well. Nice torrent walk glamping pods. But there's, uh, there's two of these nice little glamping pods. Quite decent size actually. No, there's three. I do apologise. There's three pods. And of course, if you've got a caravan, there's plenty of space for caravans as well. All with water and electric hookup. Really nice uh, pods. And 
I am up at pitch 36, which is just there. That's why it's given us such amazing views of this site, just a little bit more elevated uh, and actually a little bit more sheltered because of the trees as well. These are the other accommodations, so uh, they're kind of more glamping style accommodation. These also have a rather nice hot tub as well. And what looks to be a little toilet. Yes, own private loo. Definitely gonna be uh, having a look at one of these. Pretty awesome looking place. Absolutely fantastic for a uh, family getaway where all you've got to do is bring your uh, clothing and uh, some food and everything's there. There's actually two of these. Uh, this is the bigger unit, so uh, if you've got a large family or a large group, this will come in quite handy. Cheers. Oh wow, that's that's absolutely fantastic. Oh, that salmon is amazing. Crispy veggies, lovely goat's cheese sauce, plenty of um, energy for tomorrow's biking at um, Dubby Bike Park.
campers. Well, it's about six in the morning. It's quite bright outside. And uh, yeah, the, uh, the tent has been fantastic. It's super dark. And uh, yeah, until the road noise, it's been super quiet as well. So cracking night's sleep. Time to get up and have a nice coffee. If you enjoyed this video and would like to see a couple of other related videos, check these out. This video shows the review of the tent in this video, and this video is the reason for my visit to Wales. Enjoy!